Hey, what's up guys? Clickwood here back again bringing you another Madden 15 Ultimate Team video. And today guys, what we're going to be doing is opening up some packs. I know that sounds crazy, opening up packs in late July, but hey, I'm I'm a crazy person, right? I need some stuff to do for giveaways for you guys because yes, we are going to be eventually giving away my entire team, whether it be on YouTube, whether it be on stream. I'm not exactly certain how I'm going to do it yet. Definitely some pink slips will be involved, so be sure to stay tuned to this channel if you want to win my team. I'll quick show you guys my lineup just real, real fast. I'm not going to sit and mess around on it. You guys can pause the video and watch it if you want to, but um, here is the lineup right here with the offense. And then on defense, we've got this going on. So uh, a pretty good lineup. It is a 99 overall lineup. So it's definitely something where if you guys are uh, somebody with a lower overall team, hopefully I'll be able to help you out by giving you some good stuff. Uh, like I said, I haven't exactly decided how I'm going to do the giveaways yet, but we will eventually be giving away the whole team just like I did last year on Madden 25. So if you guys are watching this video months from now, please don't message me and ask me if I have Madden 15 stuff because I will not have Madden 15 things once Madden 16 comes out, I will have given away everything that I have. But, like I said, I want to get more stuff to give away. So I've got a couple of large quick sells. And, and you know, it's kind of funny is that um, I actually hadn't opened up any large quick sells all year until now. This is the first time. And, and honestly, it's because, like, I'm at the point where I just don't even really care that much anymore about my coins. So uh, I've been pretty darn stingy about not buying stuff throughout the year and definitely not doing these large quick sells because for the most part, they're pretty much a ripoff. But um, I do want to open up them. So let's see what we get in the first one. It is 2K, of course. Um, 2,000 coins, just absolutely ridiculous. I guess I'm not that surprised. Um, and then uh, let's see here what we get in the second one. 7.5K. 7.5K. <sighs> Yay. So we do two large quick sells. We get a total of 9.5K. That's pretty darn disappointing. But what can you do? Um, I just noticed that the video is skipping a little bit, guys. So I apologize. I'm going to quick pause this video at this point. All right, guys. We're back. Sorry about that. I don't know uh, what was going on there. But hopefully we fixed the lagging situation in the video. that So that now we can actually get some high quality stuff going for you guys here. Um, so sorry about that again. Hopefully it didn't lag too bad in the video. But we'll take a look here and see what we can pull in these premium packs, guys. If you don't know what you can actually get in these things... I would say they're definitely worth it. Um, you get two silver or better badges. The silver badges themselves are going for about 1,000 coins, so you're at least getting 2,000 coins in badges back. Um, the gold badges are going for 5,000 right now, roughly, on the PlayStation 4 anyway. So uh, if you pull two of those gold badges, you get 10,000 coins. That's about your half your money back right there. Then you're also going to get three gold or better players, so they could be elites, they could be, um, you know, they could just be a standard gold card, but uh, some of the gold cards are actually pretty expensive. Then obviously you get the three silver or better players, which is nice because you're not going to get any bronze players. The bronze players across the board are worthless, at least with the silvers, if you get something that's like 70 or above, there's a chance that it's going to be a rare card. I know there aren't that many of them, but there are definitely some silver cards that are worth 25 to uh, even up to 100,000 coins right now. So uh, definitely go in here and buy these premium packs instead of pro packs. That's my opinion. That's what I would very highly recommend. And then you're still going to get your four team items for you know your sets if you want to do those. So we're going to open up five of these things. Um, see what we can pull in this. There are 300 points as well, which actually isn't that bad of a price if you consider the fact that they're only double the price of the pro packs. So, I mean, if you are going to buy them with points, I guess this is kind of the time to do it. I don't know. I still really wouldn't recommend buying these things with points at this point just because, you know, man, we're really coming down to the end of Madden right now. So, uh, anyways, let's go in here and buy five of these things. First one, let's see here. I haven't opened up any of these things yet. So hopefully we can get something decent here. And we get a Dylan Gandy. I don't think he's worth anything, but I'm not 100% certain on that. Alfred Morris, Silver Badge, another Silver Badge. Uh, Rashad Jones, Nick Foles, and Jets Home Jersey. So I don't think any of these are worth anything. I usually keep all of my cards. I usually keep all of my golds just to check them after the fact. And then uh, I keep anything that's 70 or above for Silvers. So we'll see if we get anything out of any of those, but I'm, I'm not remembering any of those players being worth anything. So that was kind of a bad pack. Let's see what we can get in pack number two here. And here we go. And nothing so far. 
Lance Briggs, I don't think he's worth anything. Yeah, not not much so far. Paul Puzlozny, and okay, so we get an elite badge. All right, so at least the elite badge will come close to, or even maybe even more than pay for our uh, our pack here. So that's actually not too bad. We're definitely fans of that. Um, that our premium pack, excuse me. So that's really not too bad. Uh, we get the the elite badge. That should pay for it. All these silvers are worthless, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, there there isn't really any silver that I'm aware of that's uh, under 70 overall that's worth anything. Just quick hack for you guys there if you're uh, if you're still opening up packs here and you're not for certain what's worth anything. Let's open up our third premium pack here, and we get nothing so far. Okay, Heath Miller and a gold badge. Okay, silver badge. Eric Decker. Don't really think any of these are really worth a whole lot. Now, again, I'm not trying to say... Here, here's the thing. I know I said, like, it, you should open up premium packs. What I'm meaning to say is if you're going to open up packs, you should open up premium packs at this point. Um, there's really not a whole uh, point to opening up pro packs because you're getting worse odds. I mean, that is just for the money. If you open up three pro packs, it's going to cost more than it would to open up a premium pack, and you're going to get less for your money. So just think about that as you're opening up these packs. Again, I'm not trying to advocate opening up packs at this point because obviously, as you see, I just had don't, don't really pull anything typically. We did get the one elite badge that'll kind of pay for the pack, but that's about it. So let's see here. Let's continue to open up these things. And, okay, so we get an all-rookie Zach Martin. That's pretty damn cool. You guys know I'm a Cowboys fan. Um, so we will eventually be giving this card away, I'm sure. Um, I don't know. I don't think this is worth a whole lot right now. But uh, definitely Zach Martin is one of the, the better all-rookie cards that they put out. So I'm a, I'm a fan of that. Uh, Patrick DeMarco. Don't think that's worth much. A gold badge. That's cool. Uh, Justin Durant. Silver badge. Ibaka. And Denor Searcy. So... Uh, yeah, I mean, we pretty much just got the, um, the Zach Martin in this pack, but, hey, I mean, at least it's an elite pull. I know it's, it's like, at this point in Madden, we should pretty much be getting an elite in every pack, as far as I'm concerned, um, but, hey, you know what, we'll take what we can get at this point. So, Zach Martin is our, our second elite pull out of the two premium pack or the, the four premium packs that we've pulled, and now we've still got one more, so we will see what we can pull in this final premium pack. Guys, if you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to hit that like button. Of course, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Um, I would greatly appreciate it, guys. We get the gold badge there, a silver badge. Garbage, 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 garbage. And, okay, Corey Lujay. As, as, uh, I, always, I always refer to him as Corey Lugay because that's what London calls him. Uh, final edition, not too bad. Um... So, I mean, I don't really think that's worth a whole lot, but hey, at, at least at least it's something. At least it's something. I think that Joe Hayden thing might, like, be the final set of the year, even. I don't think they're really going to put out much more. So, um, that card could go for something. I really haven't paid close attention. But um, anyway, though, we're going to give away that at some point on stream as well or in a video or something. Uh, at some point, guys, I will be giving away the whole team. I've still got 1.7 million in coins as well. So we've got plenty of stuff that we can buy and we can give away to you guys. So be sure to head on over to my stream, twitch.tv forward slash TV. Hit that follow button on there as well so that you guys will be aware when I go live because that's going to be your best opportunity, I'm assuming, for you to have a chance to win one of these cards. Uh, YouTube giveaways are a little bit more difficult to do just because of the, the complexity of what they allow you to do without, um, you know, you getting in trouble on YouTube. That's kind of a big issue right now. So um, I don't want to break any of the terms of service on YouTube and get my video shut down or anything like that. So I'll probably be doing most of the giveaways on Twitch. So again, make sure if you guys are interested, go over there to twitch.tv forward slash TV and uh, be sure to follow that stream and you should get an update when I go live. So there you go, guys. Thanks for enjoying the video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I really, truly do appreciate it, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.